This review has been approved by Lord Carnage. Banished from Earth Classic Game Room broadcasts from the Intergalactic Space Arcade on its never-ending mission to review everything. Stop doing what you're doing unless what you're doing is watching this show because we're all about to enjoy one of the greatest flight action games ever created. This is Ace Combat 5. I thought this was going to be an easy job. Damn it. Great our luck. I've played a lot of flight action games over the years, but this one may just be the best of them all. Ace Combat 5 on the PlayStation 2. An absolutely amazing airplane action game. New enemy formation detected. It's a flight of enemy stealth fighters. One that fans of this arcade style flight genre must play. You probably already have, but if you haven't, play it now. Immediately. Run outside and find a copy. So, what makes it so good? Well, in short, Everything. Everything makes it so good. Because everything is so good. It's, it's incredibly well done. A lot of fun. It plays really well. Great airplanes to choose from. A and the story is actually interesting. Something you rarely see in these games. I, I thought Ace Combat 4 was terrific. And this one outdoes that. While it looks and plays a lot like Ace Combat 4, it's, it's been improved a bit, but the real star of the game, in addition to a cool plot where there's some action and intrigue, is that you have command of a squadron, and you can buy planes and give them to your teammates. If you hate them, give them a crappy jet, or like a twin prop. Give them a box with some beer bottles taped to the side and say, go fly that against a MiG, have fun, see ya. Now, if you're watching this show, odds are you've played some game like this, and the formula hasn't changed much. You, you have missions, and each mission involves you destroying a whole bunch of other stuff, whether it's airplanes, helicopters, boats, targets, or just something, I don't know, important that needs to be blown up. How about a super-duper enemy sub? Yes, let's destroy that thing, or, or at least crash into it. Why not? The storyline is told through some extremely well done CGI animated cutscenes and a whole lot of radio chatter that's it's actually not as annoying as it, as it normally is in other games where they use the same thing. The acting isn't great, but it gets the job done. Before each mission, you can assign different jets that you've purchased to your teammates and watch them explode. <laughs> well, it's helpful if you give them good planes that are well suited for the mission that you're going to be flying. Got a lot of ground targets to blow up, give them something like an A-10 Thunderbolt. If you're flying against a bunch of MiG-31s, give them something that can destroy a bunch of MiG-31s. Like a cardboard box with beer bottles for wings. I hear that works well. After you've beaten the game, you can go back and try to unlock a bunch of other hidden planes and paint jobs. You score points, you can buy more planes for your teammates. It's just infinitely fun and enjoyable. The controls are excellent, and it looks incredible on the PlayStation 2. I really miss the PlayStation 2 years. They were, they were, they were exciting. I, still can't believe how huge it is. I think the developers went out of their way to make this one a better sequel than, than the previous sequels. And Ace Combat 4 is terrific. If you're going to play any of the Ace Combat games, just get all the PlayStation 2 ones. Have fun, because they're great. Let's go. Gotta be an enemy aircraft targeting the Tons of planes to collect. Lots of missions in this one. It's a bigger game than Ace Combat 4. I kind of miss the comic book style cutscenes they had in AC4, but this one still does a good job moving the plot along. The planes themselves are very different, you'll notice that right away. Good sounds, great visuals, nice looking 
graphics. I, I simply cannot compliment this game enough. If you like these kinds of games, you have to play this one. Ace Combat 4 and 5, back to back. You'll love them. So on that note, I have an enormous classic game room shout out and thank you to send to Daniel from Hope, Idaho, who sent Ace Combat 4 and 5 to the show. Thank you. I love these games. There's also an arcade mode, which, to be honest, I haven't even played around with because I've been enjoying the campaign and I want to go back and try to unlock some of the other jets. Including the ones that look like they come out of G.I. Joe or Robotech or something. It's Ace Combat 5. Lots of things to do, lots of missions, lots of planes to collect, lots of action. Lots of stuff to crash into, lots of fun. Highly recommended.